DC gang back with another man. Hey, so I'm really trying to push these videos out and hopefully I can. Hopefully these come out and respect my time. This is this is the second haircut uh, review at a shop that I'm about to do. I don't have two. I don't know if you guys can tell, but I don't. I'm gonna bring it out to the light. I'm saying it's not like when Lamont cut me and I have like all this growing out. So he pretty much just gotta clean this up. So I'm gonna have him clean it up. You know what I'm saying? Nothing off the top. Uh, medium, uh, medium ball fade. You know what I'm saying? Let's go back over here. Medium ball fade and enhancements. Uh, I asked, I booked them on books. Be same place I did with Lamont. That's just a wave or where you gotta, uh, how you gotta book your appointments now. We're getting a haircut. Nothing's yapping. We're gonna go into iPhone mode, incognito mode. The most important meal of the day at breakfast. Oh, uh, ooh, sir. Yes, sir. Strawberry shake. How about that? Had to put some ice in it. Because why not? With some cheese on there. Just a little bit. Just a little razzle dazzle, a little taste. The three amigos. Plus one. Breakfast. I just want to let y'all know that if you do go to a barber shop and you're getting like a sponge curl, sorry about the air because it's hot in here. If you do get a sponge curl, make sure you bring your own sponge. Trust me, bring your own sponge. Can you imagine how much other products and stuff being these sponges from other clients? Grease, gel, just anything on their scalp. They could have an infection and come in here, bro. Tell me, bring your own, bring your own, uh, your own sponge. Park right in the freezer. Right in the freezers. So, uh, uh. so here. My bad. So we're here. Exclusive cuts, man. You see, it said a look at the joint right here. So I was looking. I'm here. It's a setup, though. I didn't get me one of those barber poles. Review time, review time, review time, review time, man. Let me go ahead and get right. Um, my experience, it was cool. Uh, guy was friendly. He actually remembered me from when I got my hair cut by my old barber. Like, I went there once too, and that was like, for like, dang, like over a year, it was over a year ago. It was before the vid started happening. When I was supposed to, when I deployed to pull up, dang, when was that? Yeah, that was cool. Uh, we had some small talk. Cool experience as far as just saying that I'm not really that much of a, I don't really talk too much when I'm getting my hair cut, personally. Uh, and I know that's something I gotta work with actually with my customers is like, maybe a little bit more being a little bit more social. I mean, I said that he wasn't social, but I think he could kind of feel that vibe that I'm not really the talking type, cause I can feel that vibe when I'm trying to talk to clients. How I feel about the haircut? There's the side profile. And this is exactly how he styled it. So how he styled it was, 
I use my uh, my sponge because I want to bring my own sponge because like I told you guys at the beginning about uh, hygiene and stuff. Brought my own sponge and he just used pretty much holding spray and then he sponged it. But I know my my sponge can go like my hair. It's not like really a sponge because it's more like a little afro -y kind of little, you know what I'm saying? But it's just how I style it. I'm pretty sure I can. I'm gonna, I'm gonna do it after. I'm gonna style it myself and I'm gonna let y'all see. But I never get my sponge like this, like lava sponge, too. It's more like a poofy sponge than like a, you know what I'm saying? Uh, uh, like tight curls. I like my sponge gonna be tight curls. But this is like more like an afro y kind of. Let me give y'all another spin. Um, I don't know if it's just me, but there's like certain parts that I've seen that look like they could have been faded better. Like it was, I don't know if you guys could see a line or not. I was just me. Like right here, this is probably things I would never have seen if I was in a barber. Like right here, you can see like a little line. Like it could have been faded in there a little bit more. So I want to like, I don't know what he used, but I went more like this. I don't know if his clippers were gapped enough, but I know he only used one clipper. And this is the reason why I have multiple clippers because some of the lines I can't get out with the same clipper that I'm cutting the hair with, I gotta actually use another clipper to get the line out. So, but he used the same clipper on me. I think right here you can kind of tell it's like a line where it's not fading all the way. Not saying it's a bad cut. Anybody else that can look at this this video and probably think that this is like that's a good cut. But I'm like when you're a barber, you have a barber's eye, so you just see that because that's something I would be on my client. You know what I'm saying? So like I said, right here it probably goes. Um, I need my mirror. It's a pretty cool cut. I recommend the shop. I do recommend the shop. I recommend the shop. They got a five. Uh, they got a five. Uh, five point zero, which is the highest you can get on Bugsby. So what we're gonna do. I'm about to go sponge my hair. This stuff right here is by um, it's Gorilla Snot Gel. So I got it at Walmart. It smells like kind of like bath soap. Sticky. You know what I'm saying? So we're gonna apply this. Yeah, it looks gluey. You can tell like it looks gluey. Like how it's... That's another reason why you want to bring your own sponge. Because imagine somebody doing this to someone else's hair. They put in your hair. This is how my hair will look. And I feel like it looks pretty good. I like how it looks. Let me know what y'all think. Final look. Medium drop fade. Let me know, let me know how it's looking. I wonder if y'all enjoying these videos too. I'm risking my hair doing this. You know what I'm saying? Risking my hair going to these barbers, man. But I try to make sure that I go to the, uh, I try to make sure I go to the, the High rated barbers. I'm not trying to go to any because they got some people that look like they barbers. They bar. Um, I, I ain't gonna. I ain't gonna throw them out there. But some of the places I just look at the pictures. I'm like, I will not go there. I'm looking crispy though. Feeling crispy. So, yeah. See y'all in the next upload, man. Peace.